So now we're going to um, create out the first process and uh, take a look at uh, where it keeps the files for the process. So open up RapidMiner and hit uh, new. So this will start a new process mission. And you're going to want to st store your process in your uh, repository. And just give it a name. So we'll call it my first process. And hit OK. And so now you've got your process uh, running and open in RapidMiner. So you've got your process window here, which is a graphical description of what a process looks like, and uh, an XML description of the process, your operators for your process down here, a listing of your repositories. So if you look at my repository, you see my process inside. Uh, the parameters window is also useful, as is the help window and problems window. So I'm just going to save, this process is already saved, I'm just going to uh, exit that. And I'm going to look at the process folder. So you can create it, um, a process inside a folder, but this time I didn't. Uh, but it's created a few of these files, and they're actually just XML files. So you can open those with the plain text editor, and they just describe the, uh, the structure that RapidMiner uses. And you might want to use those in the future for editing if there's any problems.